Hello golf slicing fans, I'm Kevin Ripa and this is my Sands 3 Minutes Max. Today we're going to continue on talking about Registry Explorer. Uh, I've got Registry Explorer open here and I've loaded some hives uh, from a system. And one of the things I want to show you is the SAM hive. Now before I show you the SAM hive, I want to show you what we saw when we looked at the SAM hive in the native Windows program registry editor. Remember we looked at SAM and we said there's nothing in here. Nothing in here to see at all. And I said to you, Windows is lying to us. Let's go look at the SAM hive in Registry Explorer because Registry Explorer pulls everything out. So we have the SAM hive mounted. We can go down to users. We have the user names all listed here. Administrator, LW, guest. If we click on the users, we get to see things like when the account was created, when it was last logged on, when the password was last changed, what's the username. So if we go down here, say to LW, which is the normal account on here, we get all of this information about that LW account. So we're seeing a lot more than we would have seen before. Remember the bookmarks in something like NT user? We could go in and we could look at uh, uh, the last, uh, the recent files that were opened recent docs. So it takes us straight there and we know that we have a consider considerable amount here. Uh, now as I had said before this is what Windows Registry Editor shows it to you as and you can click on each one and you can look down in the hex and get what the value is or Registry Explorer does all of the heavy, heavy lifting for you. It shows the MRU position, what the last file was of a certain file type, and the date and time that it was opened. Uh, so we get that kind of visibility as well. Now, there's a lot of stuff in here. What if I want it somewhere else? Because as you can see, I don't really have a whole lot of functionality in terms of column width. Well, I can export this whole thing. So I can, I can select everything. And then I can uh, export this whole thing out. I'm just going to put it on my desktop right now. And when I export it out, then I can open it up. And let's see what that looks like for us when it's not inside Registry Explorer. So now we've moved it out to a spreadsheet. All kinds of visibility gives us all kinds of greatness in here and we can sort and we can slice and we can dice and we can filter in any ways that we want in any way that our investigation needs to go if you are not using registry explorer you are doing yourself a disservice it's free go get it so in the meantime and in between time that's it another episode of three minutes max